Fire management. How do you like these big ones? I like them. You're doing great with them. Okay. That thing was tossing you around. You weren't gonna take it, were you? Just gotta get it done. How about you, Cooper? You like these big ones? Yeah, they're not bad. Oh, big boy. and pretty. What kind of handoff was that? Oh, that's a first rate fumble, yeah. Well, folks, I'm driving the green machine. It's a uh, hundred degrees. My Cooper and I are doing okay because of these wing windows. There is no seatbelt in here. In 1969, maybe it was just an option, I don't know. The green machine always makes me smile, even on days like today. You always get me with the, uh, the camera. I always think you're taking a picture of me. Well, I am taking a picture of you, but it's, it's called a moving picture. Yeah. So that right one's still this long. Well, I haven't touched that one yet. Okay, fine. <laughs> Just checking. Just checking. Oh, yeah. Nice knife work. Maybe overdoing your frog slightly. Okay, look at your level real carefully. You uh, have a little rise to your lateral toe quarter. So you're, you're, high across, you're high across this diagonal. Oh, I see that. Yep. Right there, right there. Yep. No! Yep. Was it a pretty flight this morning? Yeah. Nice morning. Yeah. Nice and smooth? Yeah. Yeah, thank you. When are you going to start flying? When I feel like I have the mental capacity. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah. Not, really, not, so not while it's, you're working for Cody. <laughs> not during the school year. <laughs> well, it is Friday. Rocco is going home tomorrow. Morning, boss. How are you doing? Doing well, how are you today? Have you had a good return to the heartland? Excellent return. Couldn't have asked for a better one. Yeah, it's been nice to have you. You look a little ornery this morning. Are you feeling ornery? Hey. <laughs> hey. on fire this morning. Yeah? What's that finger for? At least it was the right finger. <laughs> oh, this is a, a horse for short girls only. Wow. <laughs> Stick shift puts that on her head so she looks a little taller. You should try that. How tall are you? I don't know. I think I'm like 5'4", 5'3". Oh, come on. I'm taller than my mother, okay? No, is this She's Canadian? <laughs> this, this must be a Canadian measurement. Because I don't think you're 5 foot. I think you might actually classify what, as a midget. You a might, midget. yeah, you might actually be a midget. So, Kelly was 5 foot 1 on the basketball yeah, team, but she was lying. White Eyes doing another final. Are you feeling better today, White Eyes? Good, good, good. All right, so, how's it going, Nana? Good, really good. Hi, girls. So we had to do a little coke sifting. Did you feel any dust falling on you at all? No, no, not you didn't? at all. Did you wash your face? Yes. Okay, because, the, the rest of you is, is not watching. Yeah. Uh, but where is Random? Random's really looking. You're looking a little bit. Am I looking a little bit? A little bit. A little, bit of, a little bit of makeup. <laughs> Random, my friend. Yeah, the wind was blowing pretty hard out there. It's Literally, you've been sweeping chimneys. So, Big Party, I did want an explanation. You said you kind of did like the uh, the darker, darker tan that Social Penis Morton? Yeah, well, you know, you get, you can't wear the same pair of shoes every day, so if she doesn't switch it up once in a while, then you get bored of it. You can't wear the same pair of shoes every day? Yeah, so you know, naturally... What does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> I think my mom watches, I better not say that. Hey, I, I have a question. Big and Purdy says he likes a new look. He says, can you kind of switch it up a little bit on him? He said you can't wear the same pair of shoes every day. What does that mean? I think he's discussing shoes right now. <laughs> I don't pretend to know what goes on in his head. Okay. What do you think that means? That's a good question, huh? I have no idea. I bet that's true. Half of the stuff they talk about, I don't know. So I doubt that I would know what that would mean. Can you wear the same pair of shoes every day? I mean, I kind of have to. So, you could. It's possible. Yeah. 
Wait, so she can't wear. Well, he, he said he can't. He can't wear. That's what he said. He said you can't wear the same pair of shoes every day. Why? I don't know. What do you think? He wasn't talking about shoes, but. <laughs> I don't know. Claire, Claire says you can wear the same pair of shoes every day. I'm, I'm sure Claire didn't say that. <laughs> well, when she's wearing heels for the rest of her life, she can give me a call and tell you how they go. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Are you a pair of heels? Am I? I I've worn heels occasionally. You know, I find that like my figure looks better with like wedgies instead, but... <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> Alright, can I uh, can I get a visual? A visual? Yeah. Like, if you're like up on your heels, you know, usually it firms up the back end a little bit. Super is a nice show most nights. Oh, I don't make it all that tight. <laughs> yeah, see, if you're not wearing heels all this time, you're not just pumped up. I said you couldn't do that every day. Not every day, though. So it's retest time. And just let them take it in the shade. There you go. When we come to school, you can have a look at the uh, the test paper they got to do. It says 2022. This is like 2024, but the retest is being a little retro. Looks like he's doing math. He's counting. My brain is working at an unbelievable rate right now. How's it going? Good. Good. How do you like a roadster? No? No. <laughs> start. How's it going? Good. Good? Good. Are you having fun? Yeah. How about you? How are you doing? Good. Good? Yeah. You're a little short for that amble, huh? Or maybe, no, no, that's incorrect. The amble's a little tall for you. What's the matter? I'm so sweaty. Oh, yeah? Yeah. That's so cute. Oh, thanks. You're going to be small, huh? Thank you. All right, now the fun begins. <laughs> Z-bars are pretty hard to make. And she was about to scrap this one, and I uh, talked her into welding it and trying to fix it. Good job. How are you doing? Great. Great. Working on Z-bar. So. How you get along? Oh, we're doing good. We got a lot of different looks on you. Hey, I need to actually get a photo of your of your passport to put up next to this. Yeah, picture. I'm sure we can get a hold of it pretty easily. Yeah, yeah. I can start <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> with the donkeys when you do their hikes. So Cody's uh, making a bar shoe for a horse for the broken coffin bone. The uh, crocodile hunter, she can go after this. Yeah! Thing. Yeah, that's beautiful. beautiful. White eyes, you look like you don't like snakes. Oh, really? Really? Or spiders, too, right? I'm a wood prefer a snake than a spider. You'd rather have a snake than, than a, a spider. spider? Yes. Wow. Spiders, you just look unnatural. Careful, clear. <laughs> <laughs> so, your horse training continues. Typical training, huh? Yep, cowboy in a bottle. Yeah. You can do a run? Yeah. Are you ready? No, I'm pulling shoes and getting them clean and all that. Are you excited? I am. I'm excited every single day. How you doing? Good, how are you? Good. Got Cooper doing another final. There's only a second one. Looking pretty close. What do you think, Mr. Pete? I think you're doing really good. Do you good? I think so. He's doing good. He doesn't look calm. I wouldn't be calm either. 
You were so calm. You like took a nap in your final horse, don't you remember? Yeah, totally. <laughs> I don't remember being calm. <laughs> How many final horses did you take for your midterm? Nine. Nine? Yeah. Well, that's a good number. Yeah. I think that's more feet than most people get to do at a horseshoe school. Yeah. So eyelashes, what's the deal with ruining all those nails? Do you, you not like Kelly and I? I know, I like, I want pretty nail eyes. Huh? I mean, I want to be pretty. You'll be pretty at the, at the at the expense of my retirement. No, no, that's not. I, you know, you should not be using 21 nails per foot. You know I know, that? I know, I know. It just, it, it Horseshoeing as a spectator sport. How's it going, White Eyes? Good. Stick shift has got a, her uh, transmission broke. You guys any hard? Yeah. You gonna get past that anatomy? Heck, dude. Yeah, I'm studying the forge. Time to be ultra dedicated to get out of here with a diploma. <laughs> All right, so we are back where the juniors came for their first Friday in the field. Do you know a little bit more now? Hey, you've actually passed your final horse, huh? I did. I passed the final horse yesterday. I was there on the rail. That's crazy. Yeah. That's super fast. <laughs> Very happy to be in the shade. What are you thinking? Uh, I swear to pair people, best teams. So we picked up a hitchhiker and come to find out he knows how to shoot horses. So we thought we'd bring him along. Hey Mark. Morning boss. How you going? Doing great, how about you? You guys don't know this is Mark Torkelson, AWCF, AFA examiner. Are these shoes or trims, you know? I do not know. Are they shoes or trips? Okay. Shoes. Okay. You remember being here before? Yeah. yeah. Was it, I think it was my first time going out, wasn't it? It was your first Friday. I think we did horses the Thursday. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is it a lot easier now than it was? Yeah, definitely. And here's Rachel. Hi, Rachel. Hello. Cody's convened uh, the, the great minds of Ferrari here. And Emilio's here somewhere. Oh. Gotta go find him. That way. That way. That way. Hola, Emilio. How are you doing, sir? Welcome back to the Heartland. Thank you. So maybe a permanent fixture. How does Caroline know? <laughs> she doesn't know yet. All oh, right. So Caroline. <laughs> yeah, and and she can she can uh, raise horses and run horses and. <laughs> yeah, we'll right, make it right. We'll, we'll make it work. I know you did. You will. <laughs> so here. Give me a fish bump. Now, Caroline, that is the, the height of emotional attachment right there. <laughs> uh, there is a inside story there. We got a bunch of final horses about to start happening. Are you ready? Is today the day? Today's the day. Don't don't make it so that I can't pass you, okay? Okay. Don't do something that's like, oh. I, I, 99 percent of this is perfect to be this is a no deal i'm gonna get that one percent today this is a deal breaker i'm gonna get it all right good luck thank you you can't see the mist in the trees but it's not mist it is smoke we got finals going everywhere kind of a dangerously hot day Definite progress being made. Definite progress. How are you holding up? How's that student doing, Cody? <laughs> there you go, poke that one. <laughs> you see special pea shoes? Uh-uh. I should get pretty good. You got eight minutes left, so I don't think you're gonna make time, but boys get a, a really nice run. You got a lot done. You can tell which ones are in a run, because they run. <laughs> I can get a good smile out of Emilio anytime. Yes, you. So next year, Kelly and I are going to go to Argentina, spend a few uh, few days or maybe a week or possibly a couple months. Yeah, that's uh, Kelly's idea, right? Kelly's idea, yeah. She asked yeah. for that, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we are tensely waiting for results. And the problem is you have a AFA examiner here. You have a Fitz examiner here. Then you have me and Cody, and how many final horses have you done? I don't know, but I lost count after like 20, so. 
No way. Oh, for sure. I hit, I hit 15 like two weeks ago. That's amazing. You did two today. Yeah. And has it been hard to keep your spirit up? Not really. I just wake up every single morning and I say, today is the day. All right. Today is the day. So, <laughs> and if it's not today, then tomorrow. Yeah, because you haven't you haven't gotten down about it. No, that's no. amazing. You know what? Though so, every day I get a little closer. Every day I get a little bit better. Yeah. So. Well, your off foot was an easy pass. Yeah. And I would guess that the examiners will be discussing the near because the near is on the edge. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That one's living on the edge. Yeah. Well, so we'll see. Well, you're an inspiration. <laughs> you're amazing. <laughs> Thank you. Well, man. I think you could see how it's more fun. Yeah, a little bit better. Alright, so, did you look? Huh? Did you look? I did. What do you think? I think it's probably there, isn't it? Let's go, right? Yeah. So, do you want to go pretend like she didn't pass and talk to her a little bit and then oh, tell her she did? Right. Yeah, no, but... Emma? Yeah, Emma. But then tell so, her that... Uh, and then tell her what a good job she did. That's not mean. What's mean is tell her when they pass. No, I think, think you just go and, like, hang your face down and act all solemn. Oh. So... She's gone. <laughs> she's gone. She, she, she's she's hitchhiking home. She knows. Emma? Oh, she's kind of a water boy. That spot was there already. Congratulations. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yes, I did. Yes, I did. Woo! <laughs> so how was your week? It was good. It was good. good? Yeah. So it's almost what six something on a Friday night. Yeah. And you are soaked. <laughs> I'm about to fuel your body with what? Skittles. Carol. And Ninja Valley. <laughs> um, listen, your uh, your makeup plan? Yes. You should. Yep. You should. That's how I show up on all my dates. All oh my yeah? Dates. Oh yeah. How's that going for you? <laughs> <laughs> Have a great weekend.